Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you a trick that will help you in spelling. I'm going to show you a spelling rule that will help you spell much, much better at spelling. So, here we have three simple suffixes. The first one is C-I-A-N, the second one is T-I-O-N, and the third one is S-I-O-N. They all make the shun sound. So, mm, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and hit the bell button. So, let's dive in. So, for C-I-A-N, we're gonna do for people. Like C-I-N, for people. So, example, physician. After all these words, you'll understand it a bit. So, physician has C-I-A-N, and it's a person right there as you see and then statistician that's a person right there and it has c i a n magician it has it is a person and it has c i a n at the end electrician it has c i a n at the end and it's a person musician it has c i a n at the end and it's a person i think i already said that and now let's go into T-I-O-N, the second one. Now that you understood the, the first one, the, ne the next one is T-I-O-N, which I'm just about to explain right now. If the base word ends in the T sound, then we use the T-I-O-N sound and avoid the silent E sometimes that comes at the end. And the T-I-O-N sound is shun, as you see right there. Example, it is abstract, and with the T right there, it becomes abstraction with a T I O N. And then accumulate has the E at the end, but we don't count vowels like that, and we do the consonant T. So it becomes accumulation from accumulate. Act, it has a T right there, and it becomes action. With it's kind of like T and then you just add I-O-N. It's kind of like that. And it makes shun. But for this, you just remove it, the E, and then you add the I-O-N like that. And then activate has the E again, but we don't use the E. Just kind of like take that out. And then add I-O-N kind of. Activate equals activation. And now we're done T-I-O-N. You... You don't have to look at that, and now we can do S-I-O-N, making the shun sound. And if the base word ends with D or S sounds like use shun. Example, compress goes to compression because it has the S sound. Com confuse becomes confusion because it has the S sound. And we do not count the E just like in the T-I-O-N sh shun. Then, decide has the D in it, and we do decision. Again, we don't do the E. And then, comprehend becomes comprehension, and then suspend, and with the D becomes suspension. So those are the three suffixes that make shun. Now, if you, if you don't really understand it again, you can rewind the video, and you can check, and you can and get a better and you can be a better speller than ever so see you in my next video and bye